Hello, this is another practice problem from AlgebraTestHelper.com. So what we're going to do here is solve this basic equation for the variable y. Okay, so the first thing I need to do, I have y minus 6 equals negative 10. So the first thing I need to do is add positive 6 to both sides of the equation. So let's go ahead and do that now. So I'm going to put a plus 6 here. And notice how I'm adding plus 6 to both sides of the equation. I'm doing it right underneath these numbers. Now the reason I did that Okay, it's because when I add down now, and I kind of add this, this first equation with the plus 6 is underneath it, kind of add it down in the column, this negative 6 on the left-hand side of the equation is going to go away. So let me go ahead and show you what I mean. So it's going to be y plus nothing is y, minus 6 plus 6 is 0. So that goes away. Okay, that's going to be equal to negative 10 plus 6. Now, of course, I'm assuming you know uh, how to do... Uh, work with positive and negative numbers, what we call real numbers in math. But if you don't, this is right here, or this step right here would give a lot of students trouble. So they would understand the mechanics to solve an equation, but just they're weak on the, you know, working with positive and negative numbers. So negative 10 plus 6 is negative 4. Okay. So if you didn't know that, you want to go back and review that. Okay. So our solution to our equation is y equals negative 4. So we got that right. That's great. Um, we're going to be doing a ton of practice problems, so you want to subscribe to my YouTube channel and, of course, check out our site, algebratesthelper.com, for a massive amount of free, helpful resources. Have a great day.